Hello guys and welcome to this tutorial. In this tutorial I'm going to show you how to create a UI button inside the cell and you can press it. Okay? It's real simple and easy. Just a few two lines of code with one function to make it right. Alright? Let's start with Twitter clone app project and start dragging button inside the cell and place it here will be great I don't know if we can change it to the um, add okay add it's okay now add the constraints to open button and the right okay let's see the an assistant editor to the preview to check if everything is correct in the iPhone 4s and 4.4 okay fair enough okay uh, let's go back to assistant editor and select the cell okay go to manual twitter twitter cell and create outlet for this button Okay. <clears throat> hide it and go to Twitter cell uh, Twitter class go to cell for row at index the first thing you have to do is cell dot button dot tag is equal to uh, index path all right then cell dot button dot add target okay target is uh, self selector let's print okay UI control UI control events dot touch up inside Okay, uh, fair enough. Okay, just two lines of code. Scroll down to create a function. Print. Let's keep it simple. You have the idea, you have the concept, and think about it. Okay. Print ln button pressed. Okay. Let's run it and check. If we click this button, it should be called the function print and display and print in the console button pressed. Okay. Button pressed. Button pressed. Button pressed. 
the this uh, this is tricky tricky uh, the this is tricky stuff will help it will help you when you are using perform uh, for segways or did select at index if you want to select the cell and you have button you can't do anything uh, you can't you can't add the button because the cell is will be selected so in this uh, in this way you can add button and also you have uh, ability to to select the cell at the same time like a twitter you can uh, select the cell and go to more details and at the same time you can you have buttons to favorite and retweet retweet it and share it okay so this is how you can deal with buttons inside the cell i hope you like it, this video please share and subscribe my channel it will be more than great so see you to the next tutorial